What's going on there, monkeys? Welcome to the next episode of a Planet Zoo series here at Coaster Monkey Studios, where we are building in career mode at Planet Zoo. And in this episode, we are on, I don't know, the 5th, 6th, 25th, 30th episode of a Maple Leaf Wildlife Park career mode scenario. And uh, we've been having fun this thus far. In this episode, we're going to build a habitat, invite... Uh, a new animal to the zoo and we are going to have a surprise at the very end so make sure you stick around for that if this is your first time joining don't forget to like and subscribe and click on that fun little bell option so you get notified of future episodes and don't forget we've got a discord now so if you guys would like to join that discord and have fun behind the scenes chats and hangouts and a little bit of community action uh, feel free to do that. The link will be down below in the comments. But without further ado, let's get on into this episode. Excited to share with you what I've been working on. All right, guys. Welcome back to our Maple Leaf Wilderness Zoo. Very excited about how far we've come. Um, I gotta be honest. I really thought this scenario or this career scenario would take less time. Uh, but I'm okay that it's it's spanning over multiple multiple episodes. I hope you guys are enjoying it. I know I'm really having a lot of fun in building this one. And I know I said I was going to go pretty. I don't think it's too pretty. I think I'm fulfilling the necessities of the park. But uh, let's take a look around and kind of see where we are and what we're going to do next, right? So here in the opening area, as my camera flies all over the place, we've got our nice little picnic area. Again, very wildernessy. Um, I should do, let's see, because I'm, no, actually I'm not going to show you guys, because I have a surprise coming, hopefully for the end of this episode, um, for you guys, if not for next episode, which would be really fun. But uh, yeah, so we've got our entryway area, we've got all this stuff going on here. Again, super clean, we created our little veranda here where you can grab a snack, watch the bears. We've got our little uh, habitat uh, overlook uh, that we stole from Delay Designer. Thank you, Delady. You are absolutely fantastic um, in teaching me and so much that I've, I've learned from you so far, which is pretty awesome. We've got our Timberwolves uh, over here, which looks great. Our little habitat, we added some dead trees in the center there. Some a brush along the stonework, rock work here. We do have an elderly Senate. He is 10, almost 11 years old. Uh, but we're going to wait until he passes to bring on another male. And that's what we'll do here. Oh, I don't want to show you that mechanic research yet. So we're just going to close that for right this second. Uh, then we got our bears, our grizzlies. So we've got our little grizzly uh, baby Trinity. She's four years old i believe she's about to become yeah soon she'll be into adulthood and then what we'll wind up doing is sending trinity off and keeping mama bear and papa bear which i'm cool with we added all this stuff in here so we got a couple of vendies uh with the atm we also added a viewing area for the bears and a viewing area for the bison now our bison have been very busy look at this one, two, three little guys, right? So, Daddy Bear, Daddy Bison, excuse me, is having a good old time. We've got two girls and a male. So what we're gonna do is, for the little guys, we're just gonna, we're gonna keep them. I don't wanna send them anywhere, but we're going to give them contraception. Hold on. We're gonna give all of the, uh, can I do that? Why can't I do contraception from here? I don't remember how to do that all of a sudden. I don't know why I'm drawing a blank. All right. Oh, wait. I know. So we're going to give all of our little guys contraception. Where are we? Okay. So we've got one, two, three. Because we don't want brothers and sisters mating. Right? That's a big no-no. And we're going to do the same thing with Emini. Because we don't want dad and her doing their thing. We've got Trinity already contracepted. Uh, so that's good. I, the setup here is, again, the same... Nothing's really changed. We've just added a bunch of stuff. Uh, we took out the vendors from here because they were costing us a lot of money and nobody's really making any purchases back here yet, which is going to change, hopefully, with my future goal for, for this next area. So, what's this? We got another habitat. So, I'm thinking we're going to do another, another uh, aminal 
Yes, I said aminal. Over here. And um, we've already created the habitat. I don't know what it's going to be yet. So let's look together and see what we're going to do next. We want a North American. Now, I've been using this, this Planet Zoo Wiki. And it seems like I can get away with... Let's see. Can I refresh you? I want to see what I have here. I've got tortoises. I've got black wildebeests. I think we're out of our North American territory at this point. What are these? Niali. Niala. Okay. Oh, yeah, these are derpy faces. These are ladies' derpy faces. I love them. All right, so we need to put those in somewhere. Keep it going to reach exhibit. I'm thinking maybe we'll do the derpy faces. We have a sable antelopes as well. Let me see something. Can I put... What can I put... Cause I got a really, I made a really big habitat for the bison and I wanted to put it with other things, but it turns out it can only be with one other animal, which is the pronghorn antelope. The pronghorn antelope isn't available in this scenario. So that ruins everything. Um, yeah. So what we're going to have to do is then maybe let's look here we have the derpy face which we saw and then we've got lemurs which i'm going to do something else sable antelopes saltwater crocodiles oh my god that's a lot i don't know if i want to do that and we're not even talking about yeah so they're not no we're not you're not the animal for me all right so let's continue looking looking looking, looking sable Snow leopards. I love snow leopards. I'm going to the timber. So that's what we've got to play with. So I'm thinking, let's do... I want high profile. Let's let's do this. High pro... Formosa black bear. The only one. Um, can I put you on hold? Hold on. The Formosa black bear. Where are you located? You're like in the middle of nowhere. Asia. One to two. Up to one male. Up to one female. All right, what do you need for space? You don't need a lot of space, only 950, but you need climbing. Ooh, that's interesting. How do I make climbing without having any terrain? For, all right, you know what? Let's do the Formosa Black Bear. It plays in like this story. We'll wait for another one to get sent to zoo. We're gonna send you over to quarantine here. Okay, and while we're doing that, let us... So we've got this setup going on here. We're going to do another building here. But in the interim, I want to throw in a keeper hut. Here. A keeper hut. And we'll do a staff spot here as well. Right? Because that's going to kind of live in this world. We've got... We've got our stuff here as far as water. Oh my god, this is broken. So while we're waiting, let's fix some of this stuff up. And uh, I will catch you in one second. We'll clip right here. All right, so it looks like we are ready to go and move our black bear over. Our Formosa black bear. So he's going to be climbing, so we're going to have to figure him out. So let's get him over here first. And then what we'll do is we will sort out what is habitat's gonna look like? Let's fast forward really fast. Do, 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 do. Why are you little man running with the crate? I don't see anyone running with a crate. There he is. So here's our Formosa black bear. So let's look, we're gonna pause. Let's see, let's start with this. So we need less long grass, more short grass. So we'll do that first. Which is easy. Boom, 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 boom. And now there's too much short grass. We need more soil. And we need more high climbing. We've got to make these go away. Got to make that go away. It's not in the thing, so we're going to leave it there. Because that, no. Um, all right, so now we've got to... Less short grass, more soil. So let's plan out where we'll put. So we'll put, people are gonna be looking here. 
They're coming in there. So let's do let's do some type of uh, thing here. Don't know what that's going to be yet. And then we'll do some type of a thing here. Again, this is just you know for placement, right? Of what we're going to put uh, nature-wise. And then we're good across the board there. So now we need a hard shelter. So hard shelter, thinking hard shelter can live in this corner right there. And then for plants, we've got temperate, taiga, tropical in Asia. Temperate, taiga, tropical in Asia. So while we're waiting, let's get the research going for the Formosa black bear, right? And all right, let's get start building on this habitat and I will catch you right after this bee build. Awesome. All right, so this is what I've got so far for the Formosa brown bear. And I'm having issues <laughs> for some reason, because it keeps telling me, hard, now it says hard shelter is 100%. Oh my God. Because it was paused, it wasn't registering the hard shelter. I did that shelter three times. You know what, dude? <sighs> Just enjoy your cave. You got a cave now, buddy. Enjoy it. Ah, all right, going back to building. All right, so this is what we've got. <laughs> we created this cool little building set up here. And I think, let's check him, but if I'm correct, he might be a happy little bear. Yep, he is a happy little bear. Good stuff. All right, he's got enough hard shelter. We should probably clean up. <laughs> My God, I'm so upset. It's just this big white thing. I've gotta, I've gotta do something about that. What if I were to take this story here? Let's let's experiment. Let's take this story. Duplicate. We're gonna bring it here. Sink it on down. 
because I was showed off. Yes, I know it's. I'm a little lazy, but I mean, hi. I deserve to be. Computer error. Much. Okay. Mm, I don't know that. Oh, that was my Siri. Giving me a lot of information. Sorry, I'm not sure about that. See, there she goes. <laughs> She's got a lot to say, that one. All right. I call my Siri computer. Yeah, I know it's weird. Let's move you. Okay, this is better. I can, I can vibe with this. And let's take you. We'll duplicate you here. We'll duplicate you there. We'll duplicate you there. That gives a nice look, I think. Look at another swimmy bear. We gotta get you a mate, mister. Alright, let's make sure that your habitat is good. Yeah, hard shelter are still good. And I think, yeah, it plays well with the story we're creating. I think. Now, let's look at enrichment. Enrichment is great. Yeah. Alright. Solid. That was pretty easy. Much easier than the bison, let me tell you. What do we have here? We have facility broken out. Okay, we'll fix that in a little bit. And we didn't even spend that much money on the habitat, which is good. Um, I'm not a huge fan of this little corner here. I'd like to, let's see, maybe... What if I take this and duplicate that here? Yeah, because I don't really like the look of that corner as much. Yeah, I think I like that better. The big black wall, the big red wall is just so unbecoming. I just didn't want, I didn't want him like being sneaky. Continent Asia, we need creepers, that's what we need. Biome, tropical, taiga. I don't remember the third one, so I'm just gonna guess on that. I just need, I need creepers. Do I have creepers? What's this? What's this? Ivy, vertical. Yes, I need ivy. Ivy pillar. No, I want this IV, right? This way it's not so bad. Let's do this. Let's kind of copy this story that we're creating here. And we could just copy and paste it. Duplicate. That's what I don't get. Why are you... Ugh. I just want like... Just put you on the wall. Oh, good. All right, hold on. All right, so we've got a surprise coming for you guys. At the end of this this episode, well, for the end of this episode, stick around because there's some cool stuff about to happen. We're gonna do something a little bit different. that we haven't done yet, which will be fun. Yeah, this is cool. All right, so we've got our black bear. Look at everybody, they're so happy. Let's get this set up with the Formosa black bear. We'll get this set up with Formosa black bear, right? Now I feel like we can probably duplicate this whole story. I mean, one, two, three, let's take you, let's copy, let's paste. I don't think we have energy, electricity here. We've got a large space. I think that's okay. I'm okay. Though. There's a lot of people coming up here now. Look at this. All for the Formosa Black Bear. Sweet. All right. So what are we gonna do next? Ooh la la. So we've got this big this big space up here. As you see, I took out the trees we had here. I put in some mulch. So we've got a planter. Um, but I did take out these guys. Now, why did I take these guys out? Well, I'm gonna be putting them back in because we did some research and what we're gonna do is we're gonna create a boat ride. Yeah, that's right. How cool is that, right? So under under um, facilities, under rides, transport rides, we've got a transport river boat ride. Yep, that is correct, guys. We're gonna be doing one of these jammy jams, right? Uh, so stay tuned. Uh, while we cut scene and we build out this whole area here with our boat ride, we're going to get to see our Formosa bear and we're going to get to see our bisons and whatever we put in the back corner over there, it's going to go right past all of that, which is really cool. So stick around and yeah, catch you guys after this uh, speed build.
All right, and there we have it. Our very quickly made, with a couple of complications, <laughs> as I was fumbling my way through, but a very quickly made boathouse on the end of our pier for our little boat ride, which goes past all of our stuff. Alrighty, so let's check and see. Let's check this boat ride and see if it's making us any moolah. So potential yearly profit is negative fourteen hundred. I've got to raise the price essentially. That's what we're saying here, right? So let me go to this. Let me raise the price to I don't know five dollars. What if I ready? Can I do with the information center? How do I? Can I? Radio enabled. So I can't do, I guess, the advertisement of particular areas like we used to be able to, like with the signs and stuff in Planet Coaster. Whoops, I'm all over the place. Sorry about that guy. So that's a bore. I wanted to see if we can do that, and I guess we can't. Information is not very informative. That's it, guys. We're going to end this. Well, in this episode with a little ride on our uh, on our boat ride here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, we are underground. Sorry about that. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and we'll catch you next time at Coast Market Studios. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more content. Catch you in the next one. Ciao, guys.